Hey you guys, y'all welcome back to the Road House. Uh, got a new accessory from Oklahoma, Joe Bronco. Uh, got a big old uh, steel uh, griddle slash uh, pizza steel. So uh, I'm gonna show y'all uh, the little seasoning process on that. So y'all hang loose, we'll be back in a few. y'all welcome back here's our our uh, new accessory here and I did do it uh, once yesterday just for a little while and uh, I did cook some little sauces and uh, made some smash burgers on there I didn't get it on video I'm just doing a little test run but anyway so I'm gonna season this up again uh, we got to get our grill up to uh, about 400 degrees so we got a little ways to go we got the Bronco coming up and uh, y'all check this out I uh, put my charcoal basket on top of my heat deflector. That way I get my heat up high to burn this thing in. So anyway, y'all hang loose. We'll be back in a few. All right, so basically, guys, just like when we seasoned up the, uh, the LSG, I just got some regular old cooking spray. We're going to put a little coat on there like that, and we'll let that sit on there. I ain't wiping off nothing. Um... After I grill this up to temple, we'll throw it on there and bake it a little while. So we'll be back. About 400 degrees right down. Let's get this dude opened up. Oh, yeah, baby. All right. I'll tell you what, that thing is solid, y'all. Hot, boy, hot. All right. That's cool, man. It just it it's made by Oklahoma Joe for this Bronco. I think this is like 18 and a half. One more little coat. Got a little cooking spray right there. All right, and that's just uh original Pam. All right, we're gonna shut the lid down on it. And it says go for about 45 minutes or so. so we're going to trim the throttle back just a hair. All right. We're going to let this go. We'll come back and check it in probably about 30 minutes. See what it looks like. All right. About 30 minutes in. We're up to almost 500 degrees, y'all. Ain't nothing wrong with that. All right, man. Let let that roll a little bit. Think about doing some uh, beef fajitas after a while so uh hey y'all hang loose we'll come check this in a little bit about 45 minutes in to an hour um a little dark spot over here that's okay i did wipe off some of the excess but hey man that'll work um i'm cool with cooking on that just like it is the more you cook on it the more it's gonna uh, get seasoned up and uh, eventually it's gonna turn that color <laughs> We're going to probably do us some uh, beef fajitas out the wild. Y'all hang loose. We'll be back in a little bit. All right, y'all. Welcome back. We got our, uh, our little griddle seasoned up. And uh, I am going to do the uh, fajita video on this one. Uh, y'all look down here. I've got, uh, I took some chicken breasts. I just cut them in strips there and uh, got some, some beef. Uh, some bottom round Angus and just stripped it up there uh, Season both of these with some of this uh, Fiesta Fajita seasoning right here y'all can pick that up just about any of your local grocery stores What have you so everybody have access it's good stuff too man all kind of good stuff and then uh, I went and sliced up some uh, uh, Yellow onion and uh, bell pepper there and I had my uh, my chicken and my beef uh i hit them with just a little touch of worcestershire and um i seasoned them up with that fajita seasoning let them sit in the fridge for probably about four hours and uh, i got the uh, oklahoma joe coming up to temp so y'all hang loose and i'll meet y'all out by the grill 
All right, y'all grills up the temp. Let's get to cooking. I did spray a little more oil on here. We'll put our bell peppers and onions on here. Mm -hmm. Gotta love that smell, man. Nothing like it. Got them onions and peppers smelling good. On with the beef. Oh yeah. What is that sound? Mm -mm -mm. Let them go a couple minutes. We'll be back. Go ahead and pull these uh, onions and peppers off of here. And uh, if I get that beef off of there, I'm going to run inside and grab that chicken. We'll be back. All right, we got the beef and the onions and peppers off of there. Put our chicken on there, y'all. All right, gang, let that go. Minute, we're gonna toss them around just a little bit. All right, it's been a few minutes. Chicken looking good, y'all. It smells good. Nothing wrong with that. Just gonna turn it down a little bit. Turn I think I need to get my fire a little bit closer to my griddle right there. So next time I cook, I'm gonna move it up a little bit. I'm gonna flip over my uh, heat deflector. And get it up you know my flames up real high to the uh griddle right there but it's doing good though y'all i'm i'm impressed with that okay this chicken is done we're gonna pull this off y'all we're gonna get inside and make us some pitas meet y'all inside everything's done and i did uh <clears throat> toast me some Flour tortillas on the on the griddle there. Get us some onions, peppers on there, a little a little beef, with a little bit of this uh, triple cheddar. <laughs> Y'all come on up here. Let's try it out, man. Just a simple little, simple little deal on the Oklahoma Joe. Cheers to you, gang. Mmm. Mmm. Y'all see that meat? Nice and medium. Yo, that fajita seasoning is really good. Mmm, got to hit that one more time. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I like that. <clears throat> That's really good. Y'all come down here. We're going to build one of these chicken fajitas. Same thing. We're going to get us some peppers and onions right down. Like that. Boy, that chicken come out good, y'all. I took a little bite. And you talk about was yum. All right. A little bit of triple cheddar on now. Mm-hmm. Oh, look at that. So i busting out, y'all. Dang. Y'all come on back up here. <laughs> Cheers to you. Chicken, chicken, what you picking, right? Mm-hmm. Mmm. <laughs> Y'all pardon me. <laughs> anyway. Thank you all for stopping by again. 
just a little simple cook anybody can do. Um, you know, just a little cheap, uh, 12 bucks worth of the steaks. And I got the big pack, so, and the chicken was like seven bucks. And, uh, you know, tortilla shells and, and all that. Little cheap seasoning right here. You don't get that anywhere, you know. And y'all don't forget to go check out Uncle Steve's at UncleSteveShake.com. Get y'all some of this good rub right here. Anyway, hey, thank y'all for hanging out. Y'all have a great weekend. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>